here we are again guys we are making or I am making another soap today um, welcome back if you're already a subscriber if you are new here go ahead and click that subscribe button and watch me make bath and body products on a weekly basis be sure you click that notification bell so you'll know when I put out new videos and definitely don't forget to follow me on Instagram at Betty and Brenda bath pride so yes, I am making another soap today, and it is a Christmas-inspired soap. I have everything laid out here. The soap recipe today is made of castor oil, there's some almond oil, as well as some rice bran oil. And I'm using babasu oil today, which is a really great substitute for coconut oil, especially for people who cannot use coconut oil. And I've added some cocoa butter, shea butter, as well as some mango butter. So today, I'm just going to use my regular soap base. I'm going to drop in these pretty little shreds here that I have. Um, I actually shaved these off of another Christmas soap that I made with a potato peeler. So they're not like the little small shred pieces. They're more like the shaved pieces. But I'm going to put those in my soap base part. And then I am going to drop in some red and green. So I have a little drop swirl. I'm going to try not to get it to go too far deep down in the soap. I kind of want them to just to hang out in that top area. And those colors I'm going to drop in will be green and red. And my green is Savage Garden from Nurture Soap. And my red will be Trial by Fire. That's also from Nurture Soap. I really love Trial by Fire as the red. It is my favorite red um, to put in soap. I will use really red from Nurture Soap as well. And I'm gonna kinda scoop that to the middle, put a few more of these on the top there, and I'm gonna sprinkle on the top some Sparkle White uh, Mica Powder, um, Sparkle White Snow Mica Powder, as well as some eco-friendly twinkle gold glitter i'm going to put that on the top as well so um, my full recipe for this soap will be in the description box and um i forgot to tell you for the fragrance i am using mango nectar and that also is from wholesale supplies plus so that's my fragrance for today i also put some sodium lactate in my water it just helps the soap release from the mold a little better than it normally would so here it is i have everything to go i have my gloves on as you can see i have my mask here i'm gonna grab my glasses and uh let's get ready to make some soap <laughs> we mm -hmm. 